I am Ana Luiz Aragão from Ela Retro Channel, and I'm here today with a wonderful Swedish singer. I'm, I'm here today with Sophie Bond. Sophie, nice to talk to you. Uh, thanks so much to be here with me today. I'm so excited because you are the first international interview on this channel. <laughs> wow. Wow. Thank you. I am excited too. And I can see you have Marilyn Monroe in the back there. Yes, it's just for you because I know that you love her. <laughs> it's oh, just wow. for you. <laughs> wow. Thank you. So, Sophie, uh, recently uh, you, your single On Fire reached the mark of more than 1 million views on YouTube. And this is awesome. And how it was for you to receive this good reaction from the audience? Well, I mean, it's always fun. I think everyone who is a creator of some sort, making something, paintings or music, or you're always happy when someone, when you can share it, you know, that's the whole point. I think that's like a big frustration for many people like like you and me, like we want to share our things. So mm -hmm. when we actually succeed, we're very happy. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Yeah. And you have an interesting musical journey uh, with beautiful songs like Angels Above. How was the experience of having your songs on TV series like The Vampire Diaries, Beverly Hills 91210, The Hills, and the movie Went Home and others? How, how it was well, for you? It was, uh, it was, for me, it was amazing because I came to Los Angeles. I, uh, I basically started all over again and uh, I, uh, I got in on like the first actually song that I placed was a song called Fallout on, on the hills and, uh, and it led to so many more placements. But that first one really like opened up my eyes for something I just did not realize could happen. And I didn't think about, you know, getting my music out in that way. So I was, it was a really, really cool thing. And, and, uh, and I kept going, you know, and it was, it was just, it was like a new era for me, you know? Like a new <laughs> So it was, uh, it was, it was really great, and uh, and I want to keep doing that now. Now that I'm back making music again. Oh, great, great! And Sophie, one thing that I, that I love about you it's your retro style that is present in your song, in your hair, and your clothes. By the way, you were beautiful in your in your video clip on fire. Thank you. <laughs> Get up before I crash. I love this style too and all this universe. Uh, my channel calls Ella Retro, which means she retro for this reason. <laughs> In your case, when this love for retro style started? I mean, I think, um, I think ma many have always loved Marilyn. Whatever she were was like, she was just so beautiful. She did it with like such grace and like, she was so sexy, so beautiful, yes. you know? Uh, so I think, um, uh for her i always loved her i always thought she was something else you know and then of course she became a legend because she died so young and it was so sad and mm -hmm. you know so we everyone remind you know we remember her being just fantastic you know uh but i think the whole retro thing uh it's just something i always um i always liked and i always you know i always had this romantic uh sort of um feeling about what has been before and and i think uh, it sort of it, it can it just you know you always look back and you get inspired by by how people look back then and and you know and, and she is someone for me like mm -hmm. that i've been doing that with oh <laughs> yeah. So besides, besides On Fire, uh, you, you released it a, a few days ago, the new single Inside Out from your new album. And I, I want to know how are your expectations about this, this new project? Well, uh, so basically it's like you always want really good things. But so, be, well, the first song, Angels Above, it's been on a commercial and it's been, you know, it's been popular. It was like easier to kind of get a start off with that one. I don't know if I can accept we're connected as one. John Lennon, what's that about? Every now we release the sort of like on the edge of the summer. And it's sometimes, you know, you do, uh, you, you keep putting things out there. And, but you also need to anchor it onto something. So I'm still looking to anchor it like onto something and, 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 uh, 
And once I do that, I think it would be a little bit easier to sort of show people what it is. And it's it, once again, to make people know that it's out there because there's so much music coming out all the time. So you need something uh, that you can like team up with to, to be heard, you know? Uh, and, uh, but my expectations are always high and I always, uh, you know, you always want the best. <laughs> but I'm also, you know, I'm also looking forward to, I'm, I'm releasing an album in the end of um, this year. And uh, I'm very excited about that, you know, so I'm, uh, you know, then we'll have more songs. And I feel like for me, it's, it's fun to do more, like, just not just one song, one song, one song. So I'm, you know, I'm looking forward to release a whole album and that I can come and perform in the countries, especially like Brazil, like countries where, where, you know, people have been listening and, paying attention, you know? Yes, yes. yes. Uh, Sophie, a uh, curiosity uh, that I want to know, do you know anything about Brazilian music? I mean, very little. I, I, I've been checking it out a little bit and like the artists that are in the same genre as me, I can't remember names, but I've been listening to a few things. And I, I mean, it's like, it's such a big market. Brazil is so much bigger than, yes. than Sweden, for example. So you have a little <laughs> bit of everything, you know? Uh, but I think it's, uh, what I've heard, it's like, it's everything from like hip hop mm. and like, and, and, and to, uh, more like acoustic. There was one girl I was listening to, I, I can't remember her name, but it was, it was more like very, uh, creative acoustic. She was, she was like different, you know, I thought it was really nice, but, but you know, she was singing in, in, uh, in Brazilian Portuguese, like Brazilian, and then also in English, but, um, <laughs> It's something nice when, when, when you sing in your own language, I think. Even if I don't understand, I think it's, it's really nice. Yes. Yeah. I, I, can, I can say some, some names uh, for you later, because okay, in, in Brazil, there, there are many great bands and singers. Oh my God, um, it's yeah, a beautiful imagine. world. <laughs> it's yeah. a beautiful world. And uh, when the hard times that we are, we are living uh, goes away, do you have any intentions to play someday in Brazil, maybe? Yes, of course. I mean, I, now I don't know how it is in Brazil, but I got my first shot of the vaccine. Uh, and by the end of the summer, I'm going to be fully vaccinated. And um, I think once you are fully vaccinated, you get some kind of um, something that's linked to your passport so that you can travel. And as soon as I can travel, and as soon as you'll have me, I, I would love to come and play. Okay. So I, yeah, I think we're all excited about sort of living a little bit again. It's, it's been a really strange uh, year. Yes, yes. <laughs> and, and Sophie, what, what are you doing in your free time in this, in this pandemic time that, that we are living? In this, well, I still, I, I make, actually for me, it hasn't been much of a change because I always write on my own. So it's more like my social life. I feel like, you know, you don't go and see shows. You don't go and hang out like uh, in small bars and <laughs> stuff like that. You just, you just sort of, so that's the only thing that changed. So I'm, I'm more, uh, you know, I'm still, I'm writing a lot and I'm uh, recording and working with musicians from all over the world um on this on this project and then you know we pick pick the best and uh you know everything takes time so for me it's been a very creative creative year actually uh but on my own you know and then mm -hmm. just meeting people like you online and and so i do interviews here and there but also with musicians we meet online and, mm -hmm. and talk if someone plays like a, a guitar in England and, and drums in uh, in Colombia or you know and so it's it's all it's, it's from all over. All <laughs> I see, I see. Uh, Sophia, I, I love your songs and and I oh. hope that many people know your sound, your art. And um, thank you so much for this interview. I wish you the best and more. I wish you soon the top ten Billboard songs that I know this is a dream that you have. And yes. so <laughs> let your dream come true. <laughs> Oh, thank you so much. You are so sweet. It's been oh, a pleasure to you. talk to you. Thank you so it's much. My, it's my pleasure. Thank you. <laughs> I'm always on the inside looking outside.